call of the wild, the angler. What's good, what's good, my fellow anglers? Welcome back to another video of Call of the Wild, the angler. And in today's video, I'll be sharing a spot that most of you all might know, but didn't know that you can catch diamond birds here. With that said, let's get into the guide. So just to start off the video, I was fishing for a college pole dominator for this week and when I was in the area, I saw potential diamond brown trout, I saw gold brown trout in this video, I'll be also catching the one as well. And then while I'm going back for college Paul, I have seen some massive barbot surfacing. So while I'm going for college Paul dominator, I saw the fish surfacing and I said why not get a rod in the water since college Paul ain't biting. Cast my rod out there. At first I used number 5 with red worm, they didn't go for it. Then I switched to number 3 hook with liver and a couple minutes after, I will say less than a minute and they bite. In this gameplay you will see it right here in action. And just a heads up, so I might say spoiler, in the same day I have caught two diamond birdbots in the same spot as well while being near fishing and this was not put together guys. You all know that Kalipa was the fish for this week for Norway. And while I'm doing that, I have seen so many fish that could have been diamond and guess what? Out of all of them I saw, two of them were burbots and were diamond in this video. It will be there. Now let's get into the guide where the baits are good and the time I recommend to go for them. And for the bait, my recommendations are liver, minnows and I think somewhere along the line red worms can be used as well. But it's been a while since I've been playing a game like this. So the red worm, I'm not so sure because they didn't go for it when I gave it to them. Could be the hook size because sometimes the hooks, when they're too small, the bigger fish won't go for them. And talking about hooks, I recommend number 3 to number 5 hooks for bear bites. Now time of day guys, bear bites are considered nighttime fish. And I was surprised that they were actually biting this good during the day. It was midday while going for call pole damnator. So in my opinion guys, you can try the midday to late evening or better at night. Now guys, earlier when I mentioned baits for it, I did leave out lowers. They also go for lowers, which I recommend the shad with like number 5 to number 3 jig head. You drop it down to the bottom of the water and you do twitching and they will go for it as well. So they don't always go for live bait or you know, cut bait as in liver. They will also go for shads with jig head. With that said, this is where the rods come in action. As you can see in the video, I have used a bottom rod to catch my diamond barebot, which you don't need anything overpowered. Once you have a suitable rod, which is a bottom rod, you can get them as well. And I did mention the lower as well, which you can use a spinning rod to go lower fishing with guys. So you don't need anything special, you just need to try the spot and you could be lucky enough. Now guys, with that information I gave y'all and sharing the spots, the bait, the hooks and the rods, we'll give this spot a try, but not only for diamond bear bites, but also for diamond brown trout. I'll see y'all in the next one.
Uh, yo, hold up, wait a minute. Did you drop a like and subscribe to the channel as yet? Oh, hell no. If not, now is the time to do so.